Oamaru has about 175 breeding pairs of little blue penguins nesting in the town's commercial tourist venture. However, another 109 breeding pairs of penguins have been identified at a nearby beach known as Oamaru Creek Penguin Reserve. The Waitaki District Council is spending more than half a million dollars on foreshore protection, which has included moving a fence further back to create more space. And Z Energy volunteers are making new nesting boxes for the world's tiniest penguin. The research scientist Dr Philippa Agnew hopes the little blues will put them to good use. We're hoping to encourage the birds to just move in here and stay here rather than trying to nest under, bu under buildings and things in the town. Yeah. yeah, we're hoping that they'll just stay in this colony. The birds that breed here naturally will stay here, but yeah, we're hoping to encourage other birds to, to stay here as well. Z Energy's Jonathan Usher said they are sponsoring the Oamaru Creek Colony for three years as part of their Good in the Hood program. He said the reserve was important for the survival of the birds. If we, can, if we can house them somewhere that's away from traffic, away from dogs or other, other pests, you know, uh, they've got a better chance at survival. So yeah, it's cool to be involved. Z are also giving additional donations in the form of a dollar for every coffee the Oamaru Z station sells to people who have already visited the tourist colony. If anyone goes to the colony and then comes and buys a coffee or a hot chocolate or a hot drink off us, we'll give the Penguin Colony a dollar for every one of those hot drinks we sell as a result of people going through the colony. It is estimated that over a thousand little blue penguins live along Awamaru's coastline, some of which can look forward to moving into new homes. Rudy Adrian, The South Today.